At the top of the list of road projects up for discussion was unsurprisingly the much delayed, much maligned Millennium Highway reconstruction project. Senior Minister Stevenson King says, not unlike Prime Minister Philip J. Pierre, he is very disappointed with the lengthy delay in the project's completion. It's not only the Prime Minister who is disgusted with the current state of the road in terms of the implementation rate. In fact, the delivery date has gone. And I have expressed my displeasure a long time ago in Parliament when I made a very strong statement. Uh, we have spoken to the CDB. Uh, we have made some changes in terms of the project management um, approach. Uh, there's, there are weekly meetings with the CDB infrastructure, the consultant, and the project management team. But that does not seem to be working in terms of further expediting the process, um, to speed up the process and to at least reduce on the lag time that we have encountered. With the deadline for delivery of the Millennium Highway project long gone and no reason on offer to be optimistic about its completion anytime soon, the government is weighing its limited options given the project is being funded externally by the British government to be precise. The government is now contemplating what are the options. Can we continue with the contractor? Does the grant loan agreement allow us to... Um, disengage and if we are to proceed with disengagement meaning to terminate the contract what are the implications considering that the project is not funded by the government of St. Lucia the only components of the project that that is um, funded is really matters to do with land acquisition and relocation of uh, residents along the way Despite the disappointment with the Millennium Highway, the government is pressing ahead with other sections of the West Coast Redevelopment Project with another contractor to be engaged on what is the second phase of the overall road redevelopment. Senior Minister Stevenson King reveals that the Attorney General is studying the fine prints of the contract to decide on the way forward. We are in a position where we are still contemplating how do we put approach the situation. The um, Attorney General is presently looking at the, the agreement, looking at the loan agreement, looking at the UK CIF um, grant agreement, and then for us to make an, a very informed but safe decision so as not to jeopardize the relationship between the United Kingdom and St. Lucia or to probably, um, you know, lose the balance of the funding. The Millennium Highway is one part of the overall West Coast Road redevelopment project, but the long delay on the part of the contractor, C.O. Williams Construction, and the poor condition of the road, with even the basic signs absent, shed poor light on what was supposed to be the centerpiece of road redevelopment in St. Lucia. Stanley Lucien for the HS News Force.